Solar panels are one of the more promising methods for decarbonizing electric power generation, and worldwide research and development is showing results. One Japanese company has developed a unique method for making solar panels more easily usable. An old firm, they've been designing and constructing roofing for 92 years. They specialize in large roofs for factories and similar structures. Most of these are made from thin, corrugated materials which wouldn't support the weight of solar panel arrays. But such large area roofs would be ideal sites for generating solar power. So the company began collaborating with electrical equipment makers to develop new technologies to make it possible. This is a rail for attaching solar panels to a roof. Solar panels are square and they are usually fixed in place using ready-made metal fittings at each corner. In our new method, you can simply lay the panels on the rails. The rails are laid across the roof and the solar panels slide onto them. Using this method, you can install solar panels on virtually any shape or kind of roof. Factories all over Japan have started equipping their roofs with solar panels using this rail system. This technology, developed by a roofing specialist, is helping spread the use of solar energy. Their next step was to begin projects in other parts of the world. Here in the West African Republic of Benin, profits generated by solar panel sales in Japan are providing electricity to rural schools for the first time. Most roofs in Benin are simple galvanized iron sheeting, too weak to support the rail system. Another method was required and thin film solar panels provided the answer. Just one millimeter thick, these films can easily be fitted to any kind of roof surface. Benin responded enthusiastically to the project and have decided to install these systems in 700 elementary schools. Building on the original idea, they've now taken it a step further. These are rechargeable lanterns. They're charged during the day by the school's solar panels and given to the children to take home at night. Homes that never had lighting before are now bright enough for children to study. Japanese roofing specialist Kawaguchi Nobuhiro is leading this solar power project. Based on his experience in Benin, he hopes to introduce the technology to other countries in West Africa. With electric light at home, the children can now study properly after school. Local teachers tell me that far more of their students are actively responding in class. Many more hands go up to each question because they're now doing preparation and review. It's just a small light, but it's so effective. I'm so glad I came here. Everywhere should have electricity. Through such international cooperation in green energy initiatives, Solar Panel is bringing light to the world.